Sisters, may our Lord be with you. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to St. Luke. The mother of Jesus and his brothers came to him, but were unable to join him because of the crowd. He was told, your mother and your brothers are standing outside and they wish to see you. And he said to them in reply, my mother and my brothers are the one who hear the word of God and act on it. The Gospel of the Lord. So we find out who is the, how do we become a member of the family? Again, I often, when I hear this, I think of my own mother. If someone says, your mom's outside, and I go, well, who's my mother? She'd come in and show me who her, my mother was very fast. But again, though, Jesus is trying to make a point. Just because you're physically related, just because you go to church, just because you're a member of the Catholic church or this church or that church or whatever, doesn't automatically make you a member of the family of God. What makes us a member of the family of God is when we do God's will. And so we can all say, okay, well, I think I do God's will. Well, you've got to know if you're doing God's will. And you know God, you're doing God's will because in his will is our peace. So by definition, we should have peace. If we don't have peace, then it's one of two reasons. One is because we're in mortal sin, so we go to confession. If we get rid of the mortal sin, we still don't have peace. It's because we're not doing God's will. So that means we've got to say, okay, God, I don't know what I'm doing, but if I'm not doing your will, tell me what your will is. And then we seek it out and we do it. We have peace. That's how we become a member of the family of God. May you know his love today and forever. Amen. Amen.